A Central Indiana high school that's had to share a football stadium for its entire 42-year history may finally get a stadium of their own. The school district, we've learned, is looking into building Perry Meridian High a home field. Mary Mills with what they're considering and the reaction it's getting from taxpayers. This is where Perry Meridian plays now at Perry Stadium. It's a stadium they share with Southport High, which is just across the street. While school officials aren't confirming anything, some neighbors say they've seen the proposal, and today they shared it with us. Instead of playing their so-called home games at Perry Stadium, the Falcons would play on home turf in a new stadium where their practice field now is. It would cost roughly $9.5 million and be built in three phases. Plans show it would seat 3,500 people, include sports lighting, synthetic turf, restrooms, and a concession building. The students we talked to say they hadn't heard a word about it. I think it'd be cool to build a stadium there, just because it'd be more convenient for Perry students, but I think that it might be a waste of money, because I'd say the school has bigger issues to worry about. The stadium that we have right now, there's no major problems with it. Don Clark lives in the neighborhood that backs up to the practice field. While a few people we talked to were worried about increased noise and traffic, he says he isn't. You know, when we have a lot of events, they have basketball games and all that stuff over there all the time. And there's a lot of parking. Um, you know, it doesn't really seem to, to blend over into the neighborhood very much. Lisa Hentrup, who'd heard of the plans, was initially enthusiastic. Just give you more sense of a pride, like you can look out the window of your school and be like, oh, that's my stadium, or for the football players instead of, I have to go all the way to Southport and our games are all the way over here. But after we told her about the $9.5 million price tag? I think $9.5 million is way too much for a high school football stadium. Um, especially it's not going to bring in that much income, revenue, whatever. While school officials have indicated that a new stadium would not be paid with any taxpayer dollars, those we talked to still have some concerns. Again, school officials not saying anything about the proposal at this point, but we'll likely hear more in the coming weeks. In Perry Township, Mary Mills, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Mary. And we've learned there's more. The Perry Township officials are also looking at $2.5 million in upgrades to the baseball and the softball fields at both the high and middle schools there.